Fitzgerald Review course is very important to me in the coursework that I do with my students as adjunct faculty. It helps me to focus on what areas of interest I know are going to appear on the board exams and which areas that I know they need to concentrate on. When the students are taking a broad course like advanced pathophysiology that's covering everything from soup to nuts, they need to know what is the go-to information. And the Fitzgerald information points me in the right direction to point them in the right direction. Well, the value that's returned from Fitzgerald is, number one, a great improvement in our uh, curriculum, seeing areas that we need to shore up, being certain that we're uh, current. And secondarily, for the students, right now we have 100% pass rate, and they are able to go out there and practice and be successful. And that's what ultimately you want with all of your students. One of the best um, advantages for me as faculty and director is that I have listened to Fitzgerald Review. I know it's, you know, it's up to date. And by providing these programs that are updated in a continuing basis, providing them with objectives, a course syllabus, a post-test, what we can do is help faculty move their resources to guiding the students more one-on-one. -on -one. It's very efficient for me, and it requires very little of my time uh, getting it organized. And with faculty, where they tend to overload us a little bit these days with, a, you know, oh, you can do one more thing, this really takes a, lo a load off my mind, knowing that it's there, it's well done, and I don't have to worry about it. Since it's integrated into the last course, um, the students get the best of both worlds. You know, it's online, it's easy access. And um, if there's any technological problems, Fitzgerald takes care of it. It's been a great system. My students are better NPs because they don't learn a specific answer to a specific question. They learn how to answer the question. They learn to think globally. They learn to look at the broad perspective and bring that in to the diagnosis for their patients and the appropriate treatment recommendations. It's evidence-based. It's sound. She bases it upon all of the standard recommendations and standards. That's all I could ask for from my students.